Hey, what is good everybody? Name is Jimmy and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you guys can probably tell by the title and whatnot, we're finally going to be doing a part two to my most popular video on this channel, which was basically my Call of Duty Keith Bowl video, where every time I died while playing Team Deathmatch, I would add another scoop of Keith to my bowl. So obviously as the video went on, the bowl would get bigger and bigger. And the channel has grown a lot since then and I've gotten more cameras, the quality has gone up on the channel. So I'm really, really excited to be able to do this video again. Only reason why it's taken me so long is just because COD has been ass. <laughs> nah, I just haven't been into Call of Duty as much as I was back in the day, but you know, this new COD has been adding some more stuff, you know, new maps, new guns. The Modern Warfare 2 intervention is finally back in the game and I have yet to use it. Just got the battle pass before I started recording. So it's about time to go ahead and get into this video. Again, I'm real excited. Now I have been saving up a lot of Keef and what I'm going to be doing this time is obviously in the last video, I had an entire shot where you guys were able to see the table, but this time we're going to actually utilize a secondary camera angle and obviously I'll show you guys as I pack more into the bowl but here is all the keef we got hopefully we have enough for this video because last time I ended up putting like 11 scoops of keef on the bowl so you know what I mean I'm gonna try to up it this time around and then also people had pointed out why don't you just add all of the keef after the video or after the match of cod is already done like just do it at the end and I feel like that would just make for a less interesting video like I might as well just kind of sit at the table add a bunch of keef to the bowl and take a rip the whole purpose of adding it as I go is because you guys get to see the bowl get bigger and bigger and bigger and you best believe we're gonna add the sound effects again <laughs> now obviously before we hop in i'm gonna go ahead and get like a quick practice match so that way i'm like i have literally haven't even played cod all day and you know what i mean the only time i play cod nowadays is really on twitch so we're gonna go ahead and get a practice match and we're gonna go ahead and take a real quick rip before we actually hop into the gameplay obviously our strain of choice for today is called some oh shit and basically it is some forbidden fruit x bernie mac so we're gonna go ahead and pack a real quick bowl of that as i said i do want to kind of improve on this series and kind of make more videos based around this idea it doesn't have to be keith every time i could just do a you die you smoke challenge just let me know in the comments below what you guys would like to see but here is our first rip out of our apex design bowl right here the uh amber purple and we're hitting it off of our puck piece i don't know what to call it anyways guys cheers let's go ahead and take this rip and get ourselves a little quick practice match again i'm really excited to kind of do this video i'm just hoping that i kind of execute it perfectly because i i tend to be stupid sometimes <laughs> cheers <sighs> Another thing I'm gonna do before I hop in is mix myself up some gamer subs, you know what I mean? So if you guys wanna to go to the link in the description or just go to gamersubs.gg and use code JIMI at the checkout, it'll get you guys 10% off. You guys are bound to find a flavor that you guys like. You know what I mean? It's keto free, zero calories, zero sugar. It's healthy energy. They have a whole bunch of cool shit on their site. You know what I mean? So make sure you guys go check them out. We got the double scoop of the watermelon ice. I'm out of my favorite flavors, so I actually need to get some more flavors my damn self. Well, anyways, guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into this gameplay. But first, I need to go ahead and get a quick practice match or two. Let's run it, man. Damn! <laughs> Half complete. Watching your victory. Take a door nap, you bastard. Take a door nap, you bastard. Take a door nap. Ooh. Taking effective fire. You know, I'd be mad as fuck. Friendly I'd probably quit. <laughs> I'm gonna get good with the intervention. Like, I'm, I, it's like one of those things where I'm kind of gonna have to force myself to. <laughs> he shot me extra just because he was salty. Where the fuck did you go, you slippery bitch? Damn, that's a big ass TV. Hello, motherfucker. Ah! Oh my god, he scared me, like, literally. Oh. Got the sniper. Bro, this intervention's actually fucking nasty. I was having second, like, I don't know, I was kind of like hesitant to try. Damn, I'm good as fuck. <laughs> I was hesitant to try to use it because it had a scope, you know what I mean? I like my iron sights nowadays, but. I think that's it. I think that's it. That's good for our warm up. 
Well, all right, guys, all I got to do at this point is just make sure that I find a good map to play on. You know what I mean? Hopefully I can land on Modern Warfare 3 Dome. I don't know what they call it in this game, but that's the map that I kind of want to go with. If not, I'll just play on the best map available. And as you guys can see here, we have a small layer of flour on the bottom of this bowl, just so that way any heat that we put in doesn't get snapped through. And yeah, man, the goal is to just have a bowl that is just majority stuffed up with Keith. So let's go ahead and just see if we can get into a good lobby. Yo, okay, so hopefully this match isn't in progress. Because I've been looking for this map for a minute. It's probably in progress. Did it just start? <laughs> Damn it. Yo, boys, we got it. We got it. Fresh match of dome. Let's go ahead and go. All right, I need to remind myself every time I die, I had to do a fucking scoop of Keith, man. It took me so long to actually find a lobby that I'm I'm kind of discombobulated now. See, I'm all discombobulated. I can't think straight. I mean, it was actually light outside when I started recording. I want to get like a, a kill real quick so that way I can get cooking. Like, you know what I mean? I just started. I don't want to start dying right off rip. All right, fuck it. Let's just go this way. I'm actually afraid to go. Fuck! Damn it. <laughs> okay, well, that's one. That was actually quite a fat scoop. There we go, Jimmy. Let's make this video interesting. I don't want to sit here and get fucked up the whole time. I was warmed up and I thought I was going to lose it for a second. Oh, fuck. Prone. <laughs> he did the same thing. You saw that? All right, are we recording? Everything's good? Yeah, seems good. All right. Ah! I just got to make sure. Okay. That's two. Go down this way. So I felt like this map would be good because it's a map that I'm definitely familiar with. I know this map like the back of my hand at this point. No! <laughs> Holy shit. Bro, we're all stuck in here. Where do we go? This is bad. Damn. Ah, he spotted me. Oh shit. <laughs> Alright, scoop number three. As you guys could probably tell, I'm not necessarily going light on these scoops either. And I'm kind of forcing myself to go around with this damn sniper, even though I know probably a higher possibility of me dying. Holy shit. Fuck you. I'm not going that way. Ah! Alright, let's flank. Let's flank. Let's flank. Let's flank. Me or you. Well, actually, never mind. Let me not flank. My whole fucking team decided to do it with me. Golly, that was. <laughs> well, yeah, let's definitely not flank. Dude, I can't see shit through that. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright. I'll have a scoop counter on the screen. I believe that's number four, but I already forgot at this point because I'm paying more attention to the game than anything. Ah. Shit. <laughs> See, this is one of those maps that just kind of brings me joy, which is another reason that I actually wanted to play this map. Because, I don't know, I just always have fun on this one. They need to add Terminal for Modern Warfare 2, for sure. Ah, please, don't do it. Pussy. Oh my god, dude, I'm so good. Bro, it feels like good old Modern Warfare 2. I'm getting crazy kills with the intervention. Look at the barrel on this thing, though. I got a upgraded barrel. This thing is massive. Just got into a random 360 battle. Okay. He almost bitched me though. You guys saw he pulled out his katanas. I caught him lacking. He tried to bring a sword to a sniper fight. Got his shit pushed in. Oh, they got a harrier outside. I don't think I'm gonna go out there. <laughs> Don't shoot me. 
I knew that was gonna happen too. Can I hurry or go away? I wanna go outside. I wanna see daylight. I would like to see daylight. Fuck it, dude. We're just gonna go. We're on our way. Oh, shit, I'm on my oh, how do I die from that? Okay. Oh my god, that is a lot of keys in there. Holy shit. I'm just realizing how big this bull is getting. You know, last time I did this video, I didn't even really pay attention to how big the scoops were. I feel like I'm definitely putting a lot bigger scoops this time. So, oh shit, okay, I saw you. Ooh, he's so lucky. We're getting hit hard. All right, let's get to the point where this is overflowing. I'm obviously gonna show you guys the bull on this camera afterwards. I'll probably end up switching the camera angle as well, just so that way we have a little bit better of a shot for the, for the final bong rip. Ow, bro. I hate those little drill charges. Those things are ass. Oh, nice. Well, that was that. Sick. <laughs> that match went a lot faster than I thought it would. Dome is a lot smaller of a map. But that's actually fine though. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, so we died seven times, so seven scoops in total. We definitely put some pretty fat scoops on that bitch. All right, let's go ahead and back out. Well, all right, as you guys could see, we have the bowl here. And as you guys can see, there's a pretty fat amount of Keef in there. Now, last time I did this video, I obviously died 11 times and I had 11 scoops in here. And I don't necessarily want this video to be like any less impressive than the last one. So what I'm gonna do, go ahead and do is add one more big old fat massive scoop, like a big old fatty scoop on here, just to kind of top it off. All right, not sure if you guys can see this, but we got big old massive scoop right there. And fuck it, we'll just go ahead and do one more. So instead of seven scoops, that's nine scoops. And this is obviously, I mean, these scoops are honestly a lot fatter than the last ones I did. This bull is probably a lot bigger than the last one. So I told myself that I wanted to improve on the last one. It's not necessarily an improvement if it's not as big of a bull. So let's get it. Only thing left to do is to go ahead and change the camera angle and rip this fucking bull. So let me go ahead and do that. Well, all right, everybody, as you guys can see when I move the camera over and here is the bowl. I don't know if you guys could tell, but we had a small base layer of flour and the rest is literally just Keith. I wanted to try to match the last bowl that we took. And the last time we did this, we were actually using a 14 millimeter slide and it was the Jared Bennett glass slide. The slide is 18 mil, so it's a bigger slide. It's overflowing. And yeah, man, I can't wait to actually, you know, get, go ahead and take this rip. <laughs> And also, obviously, if you guys do want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments below. And let me know what game you guys want me to do this challenge in. I was thinking about trying to do it in Valorant, you know what I mean, or something like that. I'm just not sure exactly what type of game would be good, because I feel like this this type of challenge goes best with a team deathmatch style game. Uh, but yeah, man, here's the bowl. And also, here's the bong, the Apex design, all nice and cleaned out. Let's see how dirty this bong gets just from this rib. So to be honest, what I think I'm gonna do is use the hemp wick for this because I don't know, I feel like it's easier to burn through Keef if I, I can actually, you know, get a little even burn going. So we're gonna go ahead and use the hemp wick. And if I need to use the little torch lighter to finish it off, then I guess I will. But you know, I, I don't want to use the torch for a Keef rip to be honest. All right, guys, once again, don't want to sit here and waste your guys' time too much. Let me go ahead and just kind of set the camera kind of in a way to where you guys can actually see this rip a little better. And then we're just going to go ahead and tackle this rip, y'all. Got to get the RGB pup going. Well, all right, guys, let's go ahead and take this rip. It is actually pretty late when I started filming this. It was actually light outside. It is actually 9.14 p.m. And this is probably going to be the last fat rip that I take before I take my ass to sleep. <laughs> Cheers, y'all. Call of Duty, but every time I die, I add Keith to my bowl. Part two. Okay. God, I always forgot how much Kif heats. Kif heats. I almost forget how much Keith hits, man. That shit like, boom, it's like a dab almost. 
I don't really think there's much left in there, but it's not necessarily white ashes. So let me see if there's anything left. Kinda, sorta. Well, all right, guys, <clears throat> for the most part, it's probably gonna wrap it up for this video. I really do apologize for kind of taking so long to do a part two to this video, but you guys can definitely expect a part three. I really do enjoy making these types of videos. And obviously, if you guys enjoy these videos, obviously leave a like, subscribe, comment, share the video, you know what I mean? All that other bullshit that YouTubers usually say. Peace out, y'all.